Welcome to Orange County Fire Rescue. We are very, very excited this evening to be the kickoff group for the Mayor's Citizens Academy. You are in the fire department headquarters building. Uh, a lot goes on with this building. In addition to being the fire department headquarters building, if you are in unincorporated Orange County and you dial 911, that phone is picked up here. This is the Brain Center where all of the information is received so that we can continue to run county government and make sure that everyone who's, who's in crisis because of the storm or some other disaster, that we're there to provide the assistance that's needed. Through uh, the various decades of my public service, uh, we have now retooled it to do something slightly different than ever been done before. I have a great team of people who are going to make sure that you're going to have an informative time, a good time, and uh, hopefully encourage you to know that Orange County is in good hands with the various people who are the public servants here within this county. This is an exciting program for us. It gives the citizens a chance to actually see what fire rescue offers. This is their fire department. Our main goal every day is to serve and protect the citizens and visitors of Orange County. Uh, so we want to show them you know, what their tax money is paying for and the apparatus and the equipment that we use uh, for them and to provide that service to them as well. What you see behind me right here is our Marine Tandem unit. This is one of seven uh, of these units we've purchased in the last year made a really big investment in water rescue. When we're giving them a, a showcase of the apparatus, uh, the trucks that they see on the road every day, gives them a, a better view of what's stored on, the, on those apparatus, uh, the equipment that we carry on there. We have an extrication demonstration uh, that we're doing. Uh, basically, when we have a person entrapped in a car, uh, we just don't pull, the, pull them out of the car, we cut the car away from them. Um, so they get a chance to see that. Uh, and then we have some, some stations set up on the inside as well. Uh, stop the bleed, uh, hands only CPR. Uh, so they get a chance to kind of see every day what we do. Well, what was most exciting about all of this was that fact that for the Jaws of Lies, they constantly have to update their equipment um, in order to keep up with the new inventory of cars per se. Um, I think that was like one of the most interesting questions that were asked. Remember the fire? You don't, you're not worried about the heat? You want to go at the base of the fire, where they separate the fuel from the tank? I think they, everyone should have an opportunity to do this. I think you'd be more informed of our, what our taxpayers' dollars are going through, the men and women that take care of us from day to day, that doesn't get their glory. Um, so it's, um, it's a very eye-opening, it's very honoring. Um, so it makes me feel good that I'm a part of this community. I saw it as an opportunity to be more aware of what the county has to offer, get a behind the scenes tour, meet some of the important people. I want to be able to use that to help my clients because a lot of them don't know what resources are available to them. I learned so much. I learned about like the Charles of Life. I learned about like the Tinker. I learned about, you know, like they also handle kind of like water. You know, if you're out in a boat and stuff like that, it's a fire department that's going to come and help you out. I wanted to learn a little bit more about Orange County and where our tax dollars go. Um, and I think it's really important to not only support what Orange County does, but also how we can support them more. Bringing all of these residents in and showing them what we do and explaining some of the services that we have, a lot of services that we have here. Um, then they can go tell their friends, you know, you probably see on the desk, we're giving them weather radios to continue to make sure that they are prepared all the time, all year round. But the overall goal is to educate them on the services that we provide and really show them how we take care of them.